I hate these videos. Okay guys, it's sneaking out with Skunky, even though I'm about to be 19 and basically graduated from school. Welcome to another episode of Sneaky Night with Skunky. Okay, um, I don't know if you guys noticed, but I'm pretty sure 99% of everything will be closed just because of COVID-19. Uh, that's right, I said COVID-19, you know what that means? I'm a smart guy. Anyways, before we move on, I want to put these lights on my car real quick because um, um, these are what, when I open my door, a projector comes out on the ground and like lights up. It looks really cool, but um, right now this is what it looks like. Yeah, that's what it looks like. And the thing is, oh, yo. <laughs> Sorry. I ordered some new ones and I want to learn how to put them on. So right now I'm going to do that. I don't think I'm going to record myself because I don't think that's very entertaining for you guys. But I guess I'll try to record the process and hopefully I catch something cool. I guess I can't be doubted. Wow. Use flathead screwdriver to remove the disconnected original doorstep lights. This will do. There we go. I believe we moved this. Old one, check. Get the new ones. Damn. Time to do the other one. Damn. Can I open my door? Oh, snap. Wasn't that so entertaining? Okay, let's get this video started. Okay, this is a sneaking out video. Meaning, I gotta sneak out. Even though I don't even have to sneak out. But, let's make this more exciting. Number one, we gotta wear dark clothes. So we won't be too noticeable. Number two, sneak around the house and get out the house without even getting caught. Fuck. And number three, screw all those plans because uh, I'm not doing all that work. So, uh, let's, uh, let's just get out of here. I don't even want to do this anymore. Wow. Okay guys, this is like 6 a.m. in the morning. Um, <laughs> To be honest, is this really sneaking out? If it's not sneaking out? Okay, first things first, let's go to somewhere. But first I gotta pump gas, so yeah. Okay guys, I don't know if you guys follow up on my Instagram, but recently I just straight piped my car and I cut off like my resonator so my car's a little bit louder. Uh, let's see if you guys can tell. <clears throat> okay, here we go. Here we go. Let's get a good start. Three, two, one. Barely a difference, but it, it's something. Okay, so let's go fill up my car. Guys, I'm looking up in the sky and the sun is like already coming up. Like the sky is literally blue right now. But let's just pretend it's like all dark. And you know, that's not even the sucky part. I can't even listen to music. And the, the only reason why I can't listen to music right now is because um, Lexi's on my on the phone right now and she's like sleeping right now. And, and she don't want to sleep alone, so I gotta stay on FaceTime with her. So yeah, I don't want to hang up and stuff, so I can't really listen to music. Unless... Gosh, I really wish I could listen to music right now. Ah, <sighs> some good music would sound good right now. Fuck you, fuck, damn, fuck. Sorry. Sorry guys, I can't listen to music, so let's just go to the gas station. Okay guys, I don't know if you guys can tell, but um, it's basically like the morning time. We still gotta do stuff to do, so let's just pretend it's night time. Okay, as most of you guys do know, um, the school year is kind of over for seniors. And the suckiest thing, I didn't even get to say goodbye to my school. Let's go say goodbye to my beautiful, beautiful, beautiful school. The fuck happened? Wow, it's so dark outside. It looks like I can't even see the roads. <sighs> I remember the movie theaters. <sighs> I remember partying. <sighs> Wait a second. <laughs> Who the 
can't fuck read books. Okay guys, literally, it's literally broad daylight. To be honest, I really don't know what else to do. I don't wanna go to Walmart because I don't wanna risk coronavirus. And literally, I seriously don't wanna get out my car. So, I just, just don't know what to do. Okay guys, I sneaked out at like five. It's like 6.57 right now. I'm like so tired. But yet, yeah, we still gotta finish this video. It's still nighttime. Bro, I'm not gonna lie, this kind of like a fail sneaking out video because I was seriously trying to get a good sneaking out video, but really... Bro, it's like 7 a.m. in the morning, I'm still trying to think what I could do right now. I got a good idea. Go to sleep, and when I wake up, and it's probably like pretty much really sunny outside, but pretend it's nighttime and have a good podcast in my car. Let's do it. I got a fart. Okay guys, welcome to Skunky Podcast with my very first guest, Lexi. For this part of the segment, we're gonna be talking about on how we met. You excited? Okay, I'm gonna tell my perspective and you're gonna tell your perspective, right? Okay. Okay, so how we met, we met in elementary. We didn't really met. We didn't really meet though. We're gonna find out, okay, we're gonna tell you how we found out about each other, all right? But, like I knew you were in fifth grade, but I just, I didn't. We're gonna tell you how we met officially. It all started on January 11th at 3.50 p.m. I swiped up on her, and cause she posted this little pretty little story, and of her, she looked, she was looking pretty and stuff. Hard eyes, hard eyes, or I was like, oh no, I no, was like, you no, said, I was like, you're so pretty. No, you put pretty. Yeah, yeah, I put pretty. Mm -hmm. I just put pretty. So yeah, we started talking and all that, and I asked her if you wanna hang out, and she was like, Maybe not alone. I was like, you know what? I'm not even gonna waste my time on this girl. <laughs> okay, till this day, I still don't know what you mean, meant by that. Like, like, what do you mean you're not alone? Like, you knew you were gonna fall in love with me, so that's why you're not alone? <laughs> no, just, I didn't want to hang out with you alone. Like, I was saying like, oh, we could meet up somewhere. Like, 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 a, like where people already at. Like, people we know, like your friends, my friends. That was lame though. Like I was asking you on a kind of like a date, little date. Okay, but yeah, like okay, she didn't want to hang out with me, and, and um, she told me like she was like, I was just being you know a little skunky, me you know making jokes and flirty and all that stuff. I don't think she noticed by all that, but she she's in my car right now, so obviously it worked. <laughs> Bye. So uh, so what were you, what, what was your what was going through your mind? Cause you know hell like hell like guys be hitting on you. I know that for a fact. I posted that video and that was before I was finna go into work. A regular like thing like oh. Just... Can you talk with your chest? Like, so, okay, okay, but, but don't act all that, man. You gotta, no, hell no. I she just acted like this because the camera's on. What? When the camera's off, she'd be like, oh my god, like, oh my god, you were so fine. Oh no, god. okay, whoa, 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 okay, okay. I mean, you was, you was fine, like, you was fine, you was fine last semester. What about now? Like, now, yes, you are, I'm saying, like, I'm not saying, like, you were ugly, I'm just saying, like. That was my best. Yeah, like you just carried yourself like you was that bitch. I'm still that bitch, but okay. It was cute, it was attractive, but I'm not gonna speak much on it. I've always found her attractive since fifth grade. I had the biggest crush on her, blah blah blah. When when did you start like having like 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 the thought of me of being like 
like, like oh, feelings for you? Yeah, feelings for me. Hey guys, so she was basically a loner. Um, she was a loner and like. No, and, no, but that's like. No, 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 no. Let me explain. Let me explain. Okay, so basically, every time she go on break off of her job, she would always eat alone. She like she'd be lonely and all that stuff. I didn't know this, but she told me. But I told you, right? I told you. I was like, remember, it was like, it was like two days or like three days before. I was like. God, please, I'm tired of eating alone. Like, can I just meet somebody? Can somebody just come in my life? Yeah, she literally prayed. Yeah. She literally prayed for a friend to, like, hang out with her. And I guess I'm God's gift. You know what I'm saying? Are you making that face? I don't know about that, but it was just, it was just like a, God, please send somebody, anybody. And then he literally sent anybody, and then it was just like him. Excuse me? But then, like, I actually like Excuse him. me? Oh, so I'm just anybody? Oh, my God. Nobody said that. You just said that. Not like that, Wiener. I'm saying, like, you finna run them over. I'm a fuck. I'm not saying you, anybody. I'm saying, like, I wasn't expecting you. But I'm glad it was you, because, like, I knew you. You know what? Fuck this. Uh